There was this four-minute warning the government would give if there was a nuclear threat. Four minutes to find her children, to say goodbye. We knew there was this place called Greenham Common with foreign missiles on our soil. We had to do something. We knew we were crazy, but we had to do it. All these women with one purpose had come together. This is the story of the ordinary women who helped end the Cold War. The arms race was between two powers. You can't just focus on one without looking at the other. It's a dance. I said, I think we should go to Russia. There was this group in the Soviet Union. They were the Russian counterparts of the Greenham women. The government and KGB consider us dissidents. And there's a car behind us with all these guys just looking at us. I've never had a tail before. That was the first time when I was really scared. There are consequences. I thought about my children. For a moment, you thought that you'd failed. We have to bring it back to the nuclear weapons. Whatever campaign we had, we'd started it, and it had to continue. You can't just stay at home. You have to go, so as to lend power. We, take we were much, much closer to nuclear war than with the Cuban Missile Crisis. The risks of doing nothing were greater than the risks of doing something. If you want to change something in the world, then you just go ahead. Don't wait for directions. If you always do as you're told, then you don't ever change anything. Power. These women Power. changed our future. <laughs>